The HIV virus may hide out in star-shaped brain cells and later emerge to infect other organs throughout the body. If left untreated, the HIV virus that causes AIDS can decimate the immune system and leave the body vulnerable to life-threatening disease. Treatments known as antiretroviral therapies can deplete the amount of HIV virus in an infected person's blood to the point that the virus itself becomes undetectable and the treated person can live a longer, healthier life without passing their infection on to others. But these medications cannot eliminate all HIV from the body. The virus hides out in so-called reservoirs, ready to jumpstart infection if treatment stops. In a mouse model of HIV injected with human cells, researchers found that the virus can infect cells called astrocytes in the brain and then travel from the brain to other tissues in the body, including the spleen and lymph nodes. Even mice treated with antiretroviral therapy showed this pattern of viral infection and migration, just at lower levels. If the treatment stopped, the virus that had escaped from the brain triggered infection elsewhere in the body. The study authors also examined the donated brains of people with HIV, all of whom had controlled the infection with antiretroviral therapy during their lives. The virus appeared in their astrocytes as well. In future studies, the researchers aim to learn how much of the virus hiding out in the brain can actually infect other cells, and whether these cells then travel through the body, as also seen in mice. As the senior author of the study said, if we're going to try to find an HIV cure, you can't neglect the role of the brain as a reservoir.